Hi everyone, welcome back on my channel. Today we will start new topic about the aggregation function. I mean, summarize, finding mean, finding max, uh, average, and let's let's start talking about this with some of the task. So here we have data from Donald from Kaggle. Uh, link it. I will put in link into description. The data uh, is about the beauty industry, and let's not focus about all of the columns, but let's focus about two, and let's ask one question for this data: which product give us the biggest revenue? So let's focus about the two columns here, about A and column F. Already duplicated here, and on this stage, I should focus to aggregate B column and delete duplicates from A. Usually, when you think about these duplicates, you can mark both column and click here on data, remove duplicates, right? What should give us? We should have just a unique value. But what we have here in Excel is showing us no duplicate value founds. And this is because in B column, we have different revenue for the columns. And here, what we can do to make it correctly with um, aggregate the function. Here we should talk about the pivot table. One of the most powerful function in all Excel is using daily for many analytics and how we can make it. Let's mark everything. Here let's put uh, insert power pivot or you can just go and make it like here the same from table range. It will be marked like everything so you can mark by yourself on the put on A one and click pivot table. You can choose two options, new worksheet on existing, so we can put it like AA column or you can make it new. Let's put it like new. It will give us the new function and how this looks like. So on the right side, we can search which uh, column we want to find. And here we have four fields. So filters, columns, rows, and values. All values will be uh, summarize our revenue on the rows, we will put our products. On columns, for example, we can put some dates or some category group if we find some. On filters as well, we can find if data have dates, if data have categories, some clients, we can filter as well. But for this purpose, for this simple question, let's use uh, product type in rows. You can already see that is aggregate. So we have just three unique values, cosmetics, hair care, and skin care. And uh, let's find revenue. Okay, here we have. Let's put in value. And when we want to change the function that we are using, we can click. We can click here and fill the value settings, and we already see some count, average, max, mean, product. So for this um, particular column, we can make um, other mathematical operation as well. If show value as, we can change the connection between the data inside. So show us no, uh, grant of, summarize of grand total, percentage, column total, roll total of or parent of total. But for us it's good to have some. Let's just sort it by the largest and ready see that our for our question the answer is the skincare give us the biggest revenue generated. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching.